We're playing Temtem. If this goes live, we're good. Yeah, we're we're up and going. Cool. We're playing Temtem. I got a little bit of a start on this yesterday. Uh, not too far, I guess. We made it to the first town. That was much more difficult than Route One in any Pokemon game. Um, I got a team of six. Not because that's all I'm catching, or I think I got a seventh one. Not not only because that's what I'm catching, but because that's all that's available at the beginning, I think. Pretty sure. Oh. I think we're going on to the next part. Are solo, I think? That's a long way to go. Let's battle. He didn't want to, he didn't really want to know. So the battles are cool. I've nicknamed everything, um, just because it's fun. Um, I should be okay. It's level seven, 11 and six versus six and six should be okay. Let's see if I got this correct. Wind blade is, yeah, these are wind. I had a, a chart yesterday. I was kind of cheating, but it worked out. I think this will be okay though. Um, this is a normal type. We're gonna, it looks like nibble. You can right click on this and I think I think they do the same thing, this is just stronger. So let's go ahead and nibble this one. Try to knock out this guy. That looks like a, it's a good hit. Fin beat. Doesn't do too much. Oh, he's barely alive. He needs one more attack, but that's alright. That's alright. We're gonna... Uru Sheol this one, and we're gonna scratch that one. Yeah, that guy's gonna have a little bit more of a difficult time to kill. Well, that's okay. Should be okay. Buggy's taking severe damage. But if he dies, it's not a big deal. He's my biggest one. I just evolved him, which is kind of fun. Oh, he's got another one. That's funny. I got, or that's fine. I got it. Others. And that's a small little one. So let's go ahead and. You know what? Let's kill him off. That should be fine to kill him off. And let's go ahead and nibble this guy. Yeah, that's one hit right there. With the proficiency. Buggy might be going down. Nope. But they're going to send out another one. They got a total of four. Pick a peck. Pig. I always say pick a peck, but I think it's peck a... Pig a pick. Pig a pick. Pig a pick. I think that's right. He's also level three, so I think... If I do that again to him... Let me... Did I, I, yeah, I have enough stamina. Uh, nibble this guy. Okay, so he's not weak. That's what happened there. That's okay. Hopefully pig... Pig a pick can't hit me that hard. What did he do? Sometimes I don't even know what's going on in this game still. I'm still new. It's still difficult. Still learning how to play. Cool. I think he used something and then I couldn't attack him for a turn. <laughs> my next attack was useless. Which wastes my stamina to waste a turn. But that's okay. We killed them all without losing anything. I think we're going to go back and heal up Buggy. I nickname most of them. Some of them don't have nicknames. I forgot to do so. Okay, we made it back safely. You go in here. The Pokemon Center, if you will, is so much better here. You just click on this thing. Oh, I'm sorry. You have to hit F. F key. And then it does that. And collect and you're good to go. That's it. You don't have to talk to anyone. You just throw everything down and... Wait for it to charge, and boom. Really good. Uh, what I like to do now is, these are my strongest. You can organize just like this. Um, but I want to work on my weakest team members right now. So those guys are going to go to the there. I'm going to actually resort this in reverse. Like that. Yeah. Um, but let's get Toucan Sam out. I didn't just challenge this guy, did I? Yeah, okay. These guys were really difficult for me to find yesterday. It took me like a lot of battles to find them. I can find a little freaking owl thing, little bird. I don't know their names, and I, in retrospect, naming them um, things. I know two Y. That's like the the real one, but like naming them was not a good idea because now I don't know their actual names. Um, we're gonna get, do that. Just get, hammer through this guy. Hopefully that does the same thing. Good. One down. He 
you lower my attack. Oh noes. Yeah, that's probably a big deal. Oh wait, let's do shrill voice. Shrill voice is this bigger, bigger and better. Uh, we can do. Wind blade is fine. Yeah, this guy's level six though, so a little bit harder to kill to go through him. He's nibble. This can actually do damage. Let's go ahead and peck and peck. Double peck. Yeah, if that didn't kill him, the other guy would have. <clears throat> and the leveling system is weird here. It's or the evolution thing is not normal. I learned yesterday that it doesn't matter what level they evolve at, it's how long you've had them while they've leveled. So you gotta help them level a certain amount of times and then they evolve. So even if you get it like level 50, he won't evolve for eight more levels. So if you get him at level one, he'll evolve it like uh, level nine. This was true for uh, the bug buggy that I have. Uh, let's fight. Let's discuss terminology. Yeah, okay. He didn't want to discuss terminology. I wonder if my weakest will do anything. They keep the curve going. It's not, you can't just like power through. You gotta like grind a lot to be able to do that. Yeah, okay, I'm level 8 and level 8. We'll see. We'll see. Got a duck. He's like, I think he's water and fighting. I think it was What is Yeah, if they go after a 2i, then I'm screwed. That's fine. Oh, uh, he's only got this one. So, oh. Yeah, wait. I can do this. Shrill voice. Does both of them. And then wind blade for this guy. I should kill Kalazoo. Psypot's taking damage. Hopefully they don't kill off 2i, but I don't really care at this point. Oh, his attack went up. His defense went down. <laughs> That's dangerous. That's a dangerous move there, sir. Oh, okay. And they evolve mid-battle, which is freaking awesome. Reminds me of Krabby changing into Kingler. I think that's one of the first times we saw that. That's cool. Turns into Ferrek. Paharek. Paharo turns into Paharek. I need to see if I can change their names back. 2Y is not going to evolve yet. I don't even know if 2Y evolves. It's like knowing nothing about the Pokemon world. It's really strange. Peck. And Peck. You happy that you got better attack there, buddy? You're not going to have time to use it. Cool. And you got 57 solar power or whatever that is. Sun power. It's their currency. Uh, we got to put this guy out front. Um, oh, I'm debating whether or not to keep him out. Yeah, that was a mistake. I can't change really quick. I told you 100. Oh, you're not her. Hi there. Hi, I'm S. And I'm Pao. Nice to meet you. I'm up for battle. Actually, let's talk terminology. No, no, not again. No way, man. Yes, wait, man. Over my cold, faint attain Temtem. Everyone wants to fight. Everyone wants to fight. Doesn't matter if you don't want to fight. They're just like, let's fight. Okay, we're going to nibble um, the weak thing first. We're going to use Windblade. Shrill voice would be nice to use, but I don't think I'm going to last that long. Especially, well, if they go after Fluffy, then it's okay. Ooh. Ooh. Toxic Spores eats me alive. Uh-oh, that's dangerous. Yeah, two eyes not going to last through that. We're going to go ahead and uh, scratch here. And we're going to pull two eye out and put in... What was the next one up? My next level nine. Boyd. Or why not my starter? I haven't used my starter for a while. Named after a Sword Art Online character, I got Sinon. Sinon. Fluffy, you scratch. Scratch attack. It's funny with sometimes some of these things where it's obvious that they try not to copy Pokemon. And they went out of their way to like use a different word that means exactly the same thing in concept. But then they're like, oh, um, yeah, we're just going to blatantly copy a uh, Pokemon with this one. Like Scratch. They could have done like, I don't know, what's another? <laughs> Graze or something. Graze, I don't know. I don't know. But they have like, they don't have fire, or they have a fire type. What's the other one that they don't have that's like the same thing? Oh, they don't have a uh, poison type. They have toxic type.
I really want to use Die Wave. We'll kick. We'll throw a kick. Doesn't do too much. Nibble's pretty good. Nibble away and Side Wave. That will finish off this thing. Oh, not with a shield though. Oh, you got a shield, you got defense. Is that gonna be enough? Nope. Good thing you use your shield. To be honest though, that uh, that thing can't really do much else. Ikako can't really do much. You know how to use those totems. Temtems. Why do you call them totems? Okay, what's down this way? More grass. Uh, the screen is flashing because I'm taking poison damage. I think 2Y just passed out. But I switched him out so I could get some experience for him anyway before he died. So let's go back and heal up. And hopefully I don't get into a random battle on the way. Yay. It's cool you can see people online. Buto Sake. That almost sounds bad. Um, it's like the happy gray area of kind of okay. Um, you can see people running around online. You can probably even talk to them. I haven't done that yet. And then you probably fight them. But they don't really interfere with the gameplay or anything. They, uh, they're just there. So you're existing in the same world, but it doesn't really take away from the single player experience. It's a nice balance. They really did like what they were supposed to do with this game. It, uh, they wanted to um, make it Pokemon, but take out all the annoying things about Pokemon and make it better, and they certainly did, man. This game's pretty good. Ow. Scratch deck. Peck. Oh, when Shrill Voice? Shrill Voice. Oh, and then you don't even need to attack that one, so give me this guy. Fluffy, we're gonna nibble this thing. And then Shrill Voice. I wonder if my 2Y feels like he's out of place. Tateru. That might act be enough to kill him, but nah. So close, though. 2Y Spoil Sport. I don't know what that does. Oh, 2Y is gonna get level 10, though. I wanted my whole team to be level 10. I haven't even, like, I don't have enough diversity in my team yet to uh, think about types, really. Types kind of enters into the co into the equation, but it's not really enough to, to make sure. Uh, I think I do have one more, though. Squad. I guess, I think you have to go in here. And the nice thing is, it's not, or not in here. Uh, it's like Pokemon, but it's like Generation 1, where there's only, like, 100 and so on. It's not, like, a million that you have to collect from the get-go. Uh, yeah, I got a Firefox that's level 6. I'm a Pyrofox from... Oh, no, it's not a Pyrofox. That's, uh... <laughs> that's what I named him. Um... Yeah, they really need to put, like, the actual name of this guy. You can equip gear. Huh. Oh, cool. You can have competitive squads. I'm not doing anything for competition. I don't know enough of this game yet for that. Cool. Um, filter. Oh, man. Wow. Interesting. Um, yeah, so to figure out the guy's name, I have to go into Tempedia. I really should not name, nickname anymore. His name is, a, he's a scale. Skyle, scale, scale. Yeah. Um, he's a neutral type though. I kind of need to figure out types here. So this is a wind type. This guy's I think neutral, which is a normal type. This is a wind type as well. This is a mental type or psychic, if you will. This is a nature type, and so is this. This is nature or wind. So we got a nature and a wind. So technically, I don't really need these three on my team. I got them covered with buggy. Um. Oh, no, no, the, the neutral can stay, not not Boyd, you get real Boyd. So maybe just stick with these three, and then get Firefox out, but I think he's a... If I get this guy, he's neutral, and this guy's neutral. Yeah, she. He and she. Um, as much as I like the other ones, I'm thinking maybe just play it easy and go on these three, 
have these three on my team, level them up like crazy, and collect other things that are different types along the way. And also, buggy freaking flies, which is cool. <clears throat> so maybe keep juggling these three. Um, yeah, it's these guys again. So it's still early in the game. It's only like technically a route two in maybe route three by now of uh, Pokemon. So it's really, really early. Oh, we got level 11 versus... Oh, wow, that did not do much. Wait, what? Why did I... Why was I able to do that twice? I mean, that was cool, but why? One-fourth, dude. Or... Oh, I think... Okay, one attack there. Strange. Windblade. Uses tenderness. Makes my attack down, that's not a big deal. So I'm learning different moves that do the same thing I know from uh, Pokemon. So instead of, um, let's do Psy Wave. Instead of like, tenderness, what is it, that lowers your attack, it's like Growl. Same thing. Does the same thing. Should have Psy Waved him a long time ago. Okay. Level 11. Yeah, we gotta get Fluffy back up. <clears throat> Let's do the, that as my team now. I love the reordering. You don't have to go into a menu and reselect everything a million times. It's just a drag and drop. It also helps that this is on the computer and not on a console. Because you have the the uh, the flexibility of using a mouse. Which just adds to so much. Oh, that's to climb up. You can take a shortcut. I have learned how to climb. There's also a climbing spot there. Keep those in mind. These are people that are chilling. Oh, that's an actual uh, trainer. Um, yep. Oh boy, you've grown quick. I remember when you were a whiny toddler, always running after your pick a pick. I'm Carmen. Oh yeah, Carmen. So you do remember? Um, how's she doing? Ina, she's fine. Could you hear that? What have you been up to? I went to da da da, -da. and then show me what you've learned. I get to fight fight this person. <clears throat> The dialogue is more interesting than the... All the trainers in Pokemon are always like, Oh, I saw you standing in the grass, so I need to kill you. Come, let's fight. The problem is, is everyone still has a, a fully healed up team. They never start with a uh, just partly destroyed team like like I do. Um, I think Psywave is good against that. That's cool. I see you also got a Lowelai. I thought the bug was useless. The bug is not useless, guys. The bug is actually really good. Uh, when it learns a certain move, it learns uh, that poison move. The toxic, I'm sorry, toxic type move, and it's so badass. Um, we're using Side Wave on this. I need to find it. my type start, because I'm not sure how it works quite yet. Oh, one off. That's a shame. Yeah, that's enough to get poisoned. Dang. Just a little scratch. A little scratchy scratch. We're going to put you to sleep. Hopefully. Defense up. Bye-bye. I think you get more experience from the trainer Pokemon rather than wild Pokemon. He's asleep for two turns. We're both poisoned. Well, Fluffy's no longer poisoned. But Sinon is... Nibble. Yeah. We put it to sleep and then you um, hit it, it wakes up. But it's kind of cool. Um, the starter does not. The starter has a special power that keeps it asleep. Even It's a stuff touch right there. That's the thing that keeps it... Even if you attack it, it stays asleep. That would have woken it up. But now it's going to do the eternal dirt nap. I just took poison damage from Kako's thing. Fluffy can just learn heavy blow. Sweet. Seems like a good good move. A lot of normal stuff. S, I'm proud of you. Thanks, Carmen. You're you're a sweetheart. Crazy old lady, I guess, but you're a sweetheart anyway. Okay. Oh. It's kinda weird, the random battles just keep you and then they kept keep you stationary for a second and then then all of a sudden you're like, wait, what's going on? And then by the time you figure it out, then 
Oh, I don't think I've caught this thing yet. I'm pretty sure I need to get this. Let's see what Heavy Blow does. I might kill it. I'm afraid if I kill it, what will happen. So let's go Scratch. Let's do a kick. This might kill it, guys. If I kill it, kill it I'll be sad. Okay, good. Okay, well, it killed me. But that's fine. That's fine. Don't kill it, guys. Okay, good. <clears throat> Perfect. So then, instead of Pokeballs, instead of Pokeballs, you have Temtem cards. Tem cards. And you throw that. And you can actually use both on your turns. So you can say, hey, both of you are going to try and just throw it just in case one misses. You got two turns per turn. But then your Pokemon don't do anything. Your, your Temtem don't do anything. You've got Genki. Cool. Electric and Wind. Sweet deal. Uh, we're going to keep him as Genki because I need to learn names. Uh, we're going to put him on our squad. And also, I like how it's not called his team. It's called your squad. Your Temtem -tem squad. The terminology is just funny because it's it's Pokemon, but it's different. And it's they try to keep everything the same. I'm pretty sure those are trainers that are going to try to kill me. Um, I need a checkpoint. I need to go back, I think. I won't be able to make it. I only got two Pokemon. Two Temtem. -tem. I'm not doing male and female of this thing. I'm not to that level yet. But I will try to catch everything I see that's new. Um, we're doing Heavy Blow. We're doing Wind Blade. Or we shall... Wind Blade? Wind Blade. Electric versus Flying is not good. Or versus Wind. Oh, shoot. Yeah, that was a bad idea. Heavy Blow? Yeah! Power. Please don't use electricity. Okay. Genki uses Wind Blade. I might actually have to use an item soon. We're gonna use Urushul. Urushul. Buggy's level 12. Aw, oh, yeah. So wind type is cool. Um, in the fact that there's pure wind type instead of like all the... Oh, it's flying, but you know, it's also normal type. Which doesn't make too much sense. Uh, we're going to use Urshul. This should kill at least one this turn. Yeah, and Heavy Blow should destroy that. Oh, no! Uh-oh. Um, we might be in trouble here. We might be in big trouble, especially special attack goes up. This is not good. Not good at all. DC beam. And wind blade. I, I haven't blacked out. Oh, that was the wrong move to use. I haven't blacked out in this game yet. Oh, that's actually okay. That was actually not too... Too bad. Tried to use it, but it failed. We're going to use DC Beam on you, and we're going to use Urshul. Well, oh, this is going to suck. No! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. If he hits me with Urshul, it's going to do... Or, yeah, it's going to do quite a lot. I live, but barely, and I can't get in another fight. If I get into another fight, all I can do is run. This is not good. Not good. And I'm far from home. And there's another battle right there. <laughs> Shoot, I need to run. Um, the Genki found me. It's only 1v1. It's only 1v1. Screw it, I'm gonna die hard. If I hit him again with that, then I'm good to go. Use the sparks. Is that special attack up? Sweet, I'm not taking damage. That should be fine. Should almost catch another one just so I have security going home. I'm lucking out. The cool thing about this game is there's no PP anymore. Like power points that you can only use a certain amount of the move of, blah, blah, blah. That's just annoying. I got a long way to get back. Luckily, most of it's not in the grass, but the little part that is in the grass is scary. No! Come on! Are you serious? Okay, I think I can kill this. I'm pretty sure I'll be okay. But that that's the last... Wow, that was the last step before I was safe. Um, level 6. I should be okay. should be okay. I might be dead. How much does Nibble do? Oh my. Okay, we're using items. I haven't used an item yet, but we're going to use a Balm for 25 HP here. Get Buggy up. Yeah. 
He's a scratch. Okay, we're good for a couple turns. Let's use Wind Blade. Yeah, we should be okay. Tenderness is not going to do anything. I'm not going to change the outcome of this battle. I'm not going to help anything. One way or the other. Because I should have enough attack to do this. BAM! Alright, let's go heal up my grossly needed team. <sighs> well, Buggy's now level 12. Buggy's now my OP hitter. Buggy's basically uh, the, uh, the uh, Butterfree of this game. You get something that's kind of a Caterpie, kind of a Metapod, more of a Metapod than a Caterpie. But then it learns some attacks and it's actually pretty good. It was pretty scarily good. I was surprised. Uh, we need this guy up front. Okay, maybe we stay closer to town, huh? I kind of want to level up everything, like, you know, see it all evolve and everything, but I mean, it's easier to do that usually in Pokemon games near when you get more... more close to the end of the game. Um, DC Beam? Sure. Electric versus Normal. I don't know if that does anything, but Heavy Blow should be a solid hit anyway. Meh. That's alright. Go Fluffy! That's my Fluffy! Look at Fluffy go. Yankee's level 6. Just like that, we gain a level. Good old Ganks. Should name Ganky Ganks. Ganks. Oh, there's an item right there. I didn't see that before. Temtem guards. Those are the Pokeballs. Help me catch stuff. Gotta catch them all in the Temtem guards. Doesn't doesn't make sense. Gotta catch them all in the Pokeball. What do you do? I gotta catch them hard in the Temtem card. I don't know. Oh, I actually don't have Pick Pack. I wanted him. I don't have this guy. We're gonna use Sparks. I'm supposed to catch him and show him to the girl in, in town. Maybe Scratch. I hope that's not going to kill him up. Yeah, it should be okay. Unless it's... Oh, <laughs> I just raised a special attack. Oh, well. This is Scratch. I don't think that's special attack. Okay, we got to do... Item, Tam Tam. Tem Tem. I keep saying Tem Tem. Tam Tam. I keep saying the wrong thing. Oh, it broke free. I've never seen it miss on the first one and then catch on the second one. I saw it miss one, but then I didn't. Go, baby, go. There we go. Sweet deal. So you waste a Tem Tem card, I think, but that's okay. You get enough of them, and the, they're not too expensive. <clears throat> we're going to put them in squad. And we're going to go find that girl that wanted to see one. There's a girl in town. I have a quest in town that I haven't done. So here's the quest on the side here. It says pick a peck. Oh, you can't see the mouse when I'm... That's kind of cool. The mouse goes away when you're when you're running. But the, the quest is over here. And it says, pick a pack fan. Pick a pick. Pick a pick. It's kind of cute. When you start, you get like a pick a pick. Pick a pick. Pick a pick. Uh, stuffed animal. So DC beam, we're going to destroy this thing. Heavy blow. Heavy blow is basically like, what, body slam or something? Oh, whatever is true that electric types are faster in Pokemon. I believe electric types are the, generally the fastest Pokemon as far as speed goes. For attack and everything else, it does. They have different stats, but like for speed, they're usually at the top of the tier. I think Voltorb is one of the fastest ones out there. Uh, let's see, or Electrode in that case. Where was she? I think she was in here. I don't know. No. And the loading screens are not too bad. This game is really, really clean. And especially because it's still alpha and stuff, that's insane. Maybe it's over here. Just check all the houses, break in. It's this kid over here. They say this is a boy. It says bring a pick a peck to the cute toddler and make his day. I don't think that's a boy. It's a lot of pink. And short shorts. Here's my pick a pick. Oh, it's so cute. Oink, oink, oink. Yay. Picky, picky, picky. Can I hold it? Sure. Oh, it's so fluffy. Look, see how it moves its wings. I wish land where you see it likes you. Don't climb on it. Actually, I like Saku better. Don't climb on it. It likes you. That's amazing. Look what I have, Dad. Yay. Hey, friend. What's your name? S. A friend. It's fine. Thank you very much, S. One day I'll have my own, very, my own real pick a pick too. Actually, Saku are prettier. I don't care. Uh, glad to inspire you. Glad to inspire you. 
take this revive. I want it in a raffle, but Dad won't let me play with Temtem until I'm older, so you can have it. It also looks like 10 is not the age for Temtem in this game. Uh, everything else is. Oh, those are the three starters you could choose from. I chose this one. I'm, a t I'm team this one, whatever this was. Uh, I should learn names. Team Hochik. Hochik. I don't know the other two. Unfortunately, I haven't even seen them. So there, that's a stuffed pick peck But I have a real one. Level 5. Okay. I'm waiting for that babysitter. Do you mind leaving? They're waiting for a babysitter or something. Strange. Okay, so we got th that thing. We also gotta find two kids in this town, but I don't know where to look for them. I thought I looked everywhere, but... Oh, maybe this person. Oh, this is Zara. My fr uh, I know Ma my friend Max. Hi, friend. Oh, my friend Max. Okay, anyway, I guess I do. So now I'm cool. Yeah, so no false modesty. I see figures your first day at the academy and dojo can personally greet you. So now I'm cool. Okay, don't let go of your head now. And I'll look at you and go and play like a FOMO. Anyway, here we're here to learn how to be Temtem -tem Tamers, not to chat all day. See you in class. Can I talk to you more? Okay. Maybe I didn't check in here. Old man, grumpy, nasty, yeah, again. Weren't you here yesterday? Oh, dude. Ah, oh, maybe it's just the game. Okay. Hmm. Where do you find Yusef and Roger? They're in this town. Now, there's people, like, surfing. Who is this? Frustrated surfer. I'm dying here. Do you surf? Nope. Too bad. I need to surf. You can, you can surf, you can rock climb in this game. You can't go any further this way, though. But there is something over there. There's a guy. There's a guy up there that I can't get to because I can't surf yet. But the water is really pretty. The water effect is gorgeous. Like, it's cartoony and all, but it's beautiful. They did a good job with this game. Who are you? Newspaper vendor. Do you have any foreign papers? Digital Tim Tim. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, they have a digital type. I guess Porygon would be that type. So instead of normal or something, it's kind of like a steel type, though, I guess. Okay. Concha. I wonder what the kids are doing now. And Mariano. Concha. Can you chop those tomatoes? No, I'm busy cooking the onions. Do it yourself. Oh, that man. Family squabbles. Yusef and Roger. Let's go back in here. It says they're in here, I guess. Tired, tired student. Want to talk terminology? Nope. Okay, good luck. Break a leg, dude. You say break a leg. Break a leg. Thanks, you too. Okay, good luck. Good luck. Dude, nope. Okay. And you don't do anything. Okay. Still looking for Roger and Yusef. I just wonder if you can't do it yet. You have to come back later. Home of the Academia. Business or pleasure? Um, business. Hello, business person. Then I'm Kyra. The local super eight. Uh, fishing boats, luxury yachts, you pay fast clippers for the tour, Kessa, Fairline, you name it. I'm S. Tam Tam Trainer. Uh, freshman at the Academia. It's a really good place. Both my sisters went there, and now they're doing really well at the Arasola Dojo. Well, one day I... I guess the dojos are the gyms. One day they hope to beat Sophia herself. Good luck, S. Anyway, don't let me keep you. Enjoy your time in town, town S. I think I'm out at side. This is the road to, yeah. I love boats. Wow, you're just like my sister. Wanna fight? Nah, not really. That'd be Kyra, she's taking care of the family. Okay. Then there's these two people that are arguing. Cubra. It sounds ridiculous. She literally loves the wind Tim Tim. Me, yeah, I'm more of a water Tim Tim. So? It's personal. Wind and water don't go well together. Perhaps we're just not made for each other. Let's see here. I want to... Well, that doesn't do anything. I was thinking maybe you put a wind temtem, -tem, maybe she'll talk to you more. Yeah, that doesn't really do anything. Go figure.
Leo souvenirs. Do you have surfboards? Thanks. I see you later. Wait, was there a building south here? No, that's just the gate. Okay, I see what we're doing. I see. Let's see. Did I talk to this person? Hi there, stranger. I haven't seen you around. You must be new inside. Welcome to Brichal. I think it's Brisal. Brisal de Mar. Brisal de Mar. I don't know. It's really cool that they put a sedia in there. Tell me about your town. Where do I go from here? To you. Okay. Ah, uh, you're back. Like the surf on the sand. Solaro River is eternal. I have to go. Okay. I think I'm pretty sure I've talked to this person. Nyad. Wonderful day for swimming. I like swimming. Why don't you take a dip? Take off your clip clothes. Um, I'm not. It's embarrassing. Temtem card gets wet. So you're one of those Temtem crazed tamers? Always going on about to... I can't swim. Yeah, okay. All the options are just dead ends. How do you like our little town? I love it. I love your town. That's it. I think that's the end of the thing. I think if we check inside the Pokemon Center thing, I think that will work. Maybe there's something in there. But these guys are nowhere to be found. Tim Deck. No. Yes? No. Please. Yes. Cool. Never. Of course. I wonder what happens if you go through every option. Mirei. Yes. Here after class. That's another player. Bargain Hunter. I heard people get special discounts at the Temporium. 30% off. You gotta join the dojo and become. Hmm. And then you get a voucher. Hmm. Let's go in the Academy. Joseph, by the way. Slip my mind in a second. Zoom gone. And I need my books and my sandwich. Any clues? You get your locker combination from the reception desk. You see, they gave it to you. But I have no idea what I've done with it. Maybe I can give you another copy at the desk. Why don't you do it yourself? Okay, I'll take care of it. Sure. I'm helping Joseph. Don't tell me he's forgot his locker combination. I can't give you a copy because we don't have one. We have to comply with R Riverine Fellowship, with the, with Riverine Fellowship data protection policies. You see, maybe he can find the paper. He must have left it somewhere. Okay, I'll ask him. Good luck. Do you have the combination from it? Please say yes. About that. The receptionist says you can't get a copy for your of your combination. We need to find that slip of paper. Where, where have you been today? Uh, let me think. I got up, had breakfast, then went to the Temporium to get some spare Tem Tem cards, then came straight to the Academy because I was running late. Could it be at your place? Then... Have you checked your pockets? Of course I have. Give me a second. Phew, it's not there. Could it be at your place? No way. My parents would have sent someone with it if I had left it there. I must have left, lost it later on. Then it must be at the Temporium. He has a muscle on my pants. Okay, off to the Temporium then. Don't worry, Joseph. I will do it myself. Temporium. Not Pokemon Center, but Temporium. Okay, who do I talk to? Oh yeah, you can sit at these things too. That's just freaking cool. You can hang out in one of these all day. I'm looking for a slip of paper. Haven't seen any. Shoot, you're not a big help. This one? I'm looking for a piece of paper. Oh, you mean like one of those little slip of paper? Yes. Well, like this one? That's it. Can I have it? Oh, I don't know. Whose locker is this? Joseph's. Ah, I figures he lost it again. Please? Well, you have to do me a little favor in exchange. Uh, I'm joking. Here you are. Thanks. No problem. A slip of paper scrawled with four digits. Probably the combination of Joseph's locker. Wow, this is... The plot thickens. <clears throat> hey, do you have the combination for my locker? Please say yes. Got it. It's one, two, three, four. No wonder I couldn't guess it. Okay, let's try it. Yes, it opened. You saved my life. Fine, friend. Finally. Oh, and there's my lunch. Thank you. I was starving. I'll have the sandwich. You take the apples. I don't like fruit anyway. I got apples. You handed over one slip of paper. Do I get apples? 
You got two vital apples. An apple a day keeps the 10-time vet away, restores 25, 8% HP. That's pretty good. The later you use it, the better. Like, the higher level they are. Percentages are a big deal. Is there anything else to look at? There's, like, this stuff. This is, like, the school in, um... Viridian City. I'm gonna liken this to like everything in Generation 1. Generally Generation 1. You can like read stuff and learn about Pokemon types and how items work and stuff like that. I don't think there's anything else to do in here. Maybe the... Nah. I gotta go to class though apparently, but I don't know if, how to go to class. I don't know. It's sitting here to catch up on it in class. Okay. Oh, okay. I want to sit here so you can like have people that would so this is the cool thing about it being online is you can chill anywhere and you can see other people hanging out you're back have you found Yusuf and Roger I'm on it make haste young ass seriously I don't know where they are I don't know if it's supposed to be this difficult but I'm really really not good at this they're not up in here up in here up in here I'm gonna sit on this bench though It's like a cyanide and happiness thing that says the, with the guy that has the most comfortable butt so he can sit anywhere he wants. Can I check in here? This is the old couple, right? Making dinner? Yeah. Already came in here. I'm not seeing anything fishy about these people that are like, oh, no, I haven't seen kids. Why are you looking for, why are you looking for kids? Mm-hmm. I'm wondering if we just can't do this yet. I think I'm going to go on because that's the academy. Nothing over here. I really wish I could look at the minimap better. Oh, you can. Oh, M does wonders. Oh, wow. You can see the whole world. Is that it? But still, I started down here and went all the way up here. Wow. And then there's this place. Wow. I don't care, man. This is cool. This is one of the coolest minimaps I've seen. You can zoom in and everything. So, check there, check there, check there, check there. I checked all three of those. I checked the Emporium. I, I think I need to check that, maybe, again. This is where I want to get to, but I can't. They weren't down here. They weren't over here. I don't think they're in this city. I think they might be over in this area, if anything. Um, so, let's go here. Pretty sure I went in here several times, though. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. So, either they're, they're really good at hiding, or... Something. Did it freeze? I think my game bugged. Oh, good. Oh, disconnect. Let's try re reconnecting. Okay. I think that happened yesterday, too. I picked up an item and then it was like freaked out for a little bit. I've never seen a loading screen on this. Everything is so seamless. Okay, I think we're good. If that was a, that was the biggest hiccup I'll see, that's amazing. Again, this is still just freaking alpha or whatever. It's beta testing, early access, and it's just like really clean. Anything you want to do in this game, you just do it. Okay, let's continue. I don't I don't know where to look at. Wait, can I go up the beach? No, I can't. No, that it's blocked by the. Uh, the thing here. Or did I... I don't think I went over here. What is your name, sir? What's your name? Pino the Old Salts. I'm S. Where are you from? Are you a sailor? That I am. All my life I've sailed these waters. Okay. Okay. Oh, let's go that one. <clears throat> so he tells lore. Robert Friedman. Wait, that was another character, right? Pretty sure I can't interact with him. Yeah, okay. Theodora. Do you know where the fairy for Turas is? It's uh, anytime now, sir. No, but I can investigate. Would you? Got a quest? Ask the Riverine Fellowship in Tereska. Okay, I gotta go all the way to Tereska. 
Okay, this is an interesting development. I haven't been on this bridge yet. Athena, well-met landlubber. I'm looking for a sailor. I'm looking for a ship. Don't we all? Funny how when I'm aboard, all I can think of this sh about is shore leave. Now that I'm on leave, I can't wait to jump on another ship. Oh, that's true. Grass is always greener, huh, Athena? Ah, uh, Solaro gets its into your veins. Huh. You'll mark my words. Not that you can understand that, you uh, being an Earth sort of person, but it does. It does. It does. It does. What about the Cheresca Ferry? A fine ship it used to be, but ancient. Reckon it should have spent some time in dry dock years ago. At the hands of a capable shipwright, the keel is just rotting away. Tell me about yourself. I'm not one to brag about my exploits much. I'm a sailor and a heck of a good hand at that. Uh... I've seen storms break out of nowhere, ship sinking, Temtem appear out of nowhere. I've beaten old, uh, beaten odds no airship captain will ever face. Tell me about the Pino the Old Salt. Ah, oh, charming old fellow, the Pino the Old Salt. He has forgotten more tales than I'll ever, than I've ever known. If he were a professor at Arbury, he, they would give him medals for his lore. He's a sailor, so they give him glasses of Uzo. I reckon he prefers it that way. Hmm. He's out at the docks. If you want to meet him, he's unmistakable. Okay. I'm gonna go. Okay, this is a dead end. I wonder if that can connect eventually. There's two people right there. Is that Yusef? Maybe that's Yusef and Roger right there. That'd be hilarious. Maybe, maybe Yusef and Roger are back in the route that I came from before. Let's go check down there and then we can check above. I think all the characters have names. All the, It's not just like Youngster and Trainer and Bug Capture. They all have names. Here's a chick. Who? Random player. Okay. Right, we can't do that way, but we can go this way. I think. Right, that would dead end there, right? We can't go under the bridge. There's no way there. Okay. We can get down there. Let's see what these... Oh. Well, be patient while I kill this guy then, and I'll talk to you guys in a second. I see your tattoo, and I raise you a bunch of levels and a buggy. Oh, I need to switch my buggy out. This is too strong. Yeah, it's connecting issues, I think. Heavy blow. So, I tried turning off battle animation, but I don't know where to, where to do that if you can. But the battle's not too bad. It goes pretty quick. There's no victory dance with no pa 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 da Agapi. Hey, Ash, you're a very strong train runner, you know? Right, I already killed those guys yesterday. Nothing there. I imagine these guys would not be too far if they are in the route itself. So I'm not going to go crazy far in here. I don't know why I'm looking for him so hard. Then you come up here. Pedantic trainer. Okay. I'm not going to go that much further then. I want to see if this guy... That's a gobby. Yota. Okay, we're looking for Yosef and... Where is it? Yosef and Roger. That's right. Dojo pupil. Shoot. Shoot! <laughs> Fa... Faharo. Faharo. Heavy blow. I need to switch out buggy. I keep forgetting to do that. Wow. Actually did damage. Wanna heal at the uh tan tan tamponium. Tamponium. Okay, buggy, switch out. Get our weaker guys going. Should have again these two. Like that. Oops, like that. Just like that. Exactly like that. That's fine. Not in here. Okay. Temporium. Oh, you can you can emote too. How did I do that? Like that with Q. You can do cute little things. <clears throat> bum 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 bum. So this game is really good. It's pretty intuitive. I didn't really follow too much of the guidelines on how to do much. 
Unless necessary, but it was easy to find everything. Exhausted Tripper. Climber. Okay, so they don't all have names. Tataru. Pick a peck. And Ganky. Bamboozle. What the heck does this do? Given the old Razzle Dazzle, the target avoids the next technique directed at it. Yeah, it's not useful then. Nibble and Nimble. Speed up, scratch, and nibble actually do stuff. So let's go nibble, and then we will do DC beam. <clears throat> this is kind of a fair fight, not really, because it's 2v1, but the levels are similar, at least. Nibble, this will kill him. Boom, goodbye. Galazo. There's no one else over here. Except that guy. Oh, you can cross these? I didn't know that. Huh, I could have sworn I was running into the barrier there. Weird. Okay, wait, what's there? There's a person right there. Galazo. 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 I don't know. Aziza. Powell. And then that goes to the uh, the shortcuts. So the varying areas. Okay, let's go up here. There was a guy there, but that's not a big deal. Or that was Carmen, I think. Okay. Here, we got those two. And then we got, it looks like a safe house right there. So we should be able to be fine here. Oh, look, a peasant! <laughs> oh, look, a peasant. Sorry, friend, he's a bit of a big city boy. So would you care for? Who are you calling a city boy? I just appreciate the rich and berry wildlife of the region, the trees, the tent, and the country bumpkins. Oh, this guy's a charmer. Oh, for crying out loud. Anyway, do you care for a little tent tent battle? If it's a friendly one, I'll crush you. Yeah, no, I understand the feeling, my friend. Ha, ha, ha. The uncle is getting cocky. We'll bring it on, rural guy. I might lose everything I have here, but that's okay. Showtime, peasant. That's how you assert dominance. You call people peasants. Say. Take that, peasant. Oh, they got the two starters. Sweet deal. I'm excited. Um, Electric was really effective against Hochik, I think. So let's try that. Nimble. We're going to do Nimble there. Or, I'm sorry, Nibble on Hochik. And yeah, level 10. I'm, I'm, there's no way I'm winning with these two. Yeah, look at that attack. Oh, my God. Tenderness. Oh, good luck. Attack down. Well, you know. We're gonna do... Bamboozle takes up all your... All your attack, though. Like, it's a decent move, but it just, like, kills everything. We're gonna do that. At least kill this guy off. Bye-bye. You're losing to level 6s and 5s, dude. 5s and 6. You're 10 and 11. You just got owned. I still got 1 HP, dude. Yeah, and homeboy just leveled. Uh, let's go with Bamboozle. It's going to take a little bit of my health, but it'll save his life anyway. DC. DC beam. Gonna do that. I wonder if electricity versus fire is good. Not really. Well, Bamboozle works out. We're gonna rest him up. We're gonna use DC beam. This one does 35, this does 40. I think I'm gonna use wind blade and see what happens. Wind versus fire. Does that just fan it? Bamboozle. You got bamboozled. Okay, we're gonna nibble. And we're gonna wind blade. And hopefully I move first. If not, not a big deal. Kill one, I don't care. Pick a peck. Pick a pig should be able to kill that with one hit here. Bam! Yeah! And that's it. They only had the two. I think I got a checkpoint after this, so I can heal up. Boom. Oh, two levels, man. But, but how? Yeah, that was really embarrassing. You're level 10 and level 11. Died to a 5 and a 6. Back to the city, boy. Good fight, sir. How dare you. That's only right. Good fight. Let's go, you. Enjoy your friend. 
Work in progress content. Oh, okay, this isn't even open yet. Like, literally in the game. Oh, shoot. Oh, well. Um, how's the time time going? I'm not, I'm more of a fighter. I'm catching loads. Sure. Give it a try. I mean, loads isn't really the right thing. I've caught eight. And two of them, two of those eight were actually given to me. Okay, pick a peck and fluffy. I don't have anything flying right here, so that's a good sign. But... We're going after the weaker one, but that should be okay. Well, they got four though. Pick back is dead. Boom. Ouch. Uh, something that's not flying. All of these will die. Uh, both of these will die. Um, we're gonna bring out this one. I think nature keeps it safe from electricity anyway. Windblade, you. Heavy blow to you. Yikes. Right, wind is not good against electricity, right? We're using toxic, okay. That was my bad. Yeah, we're we're still okay. Fluffy's leveling up. Let me see. Get ready. Let me see. Oh, where's my electricity now? I think that's water. They also don't have um They don't have uh dragon type in this game. Or anything similar. Okay. This might be able to kill it. Yeah. Very cool. Fluffy's got to take a break. But Buggy's almost level 12. Yup. Alright, we're, we're Shoal. And Heavy Blow, I can scratch without taking. Without ruining my stamina stuff here. Yeah, it should be fine. Oh shoot, I should have done it against the same one. Oh well. My bad. Yeah, because now they get two attacks. And they killed Fluffy! They killed my Fluffy. Fluffy? That's okay, I don't have electricity to worry about right now. Um, they don't even let you choose when there's only one left. That's good. That's smart. That's really smart. Because everything else is like, oh, which one do you want? Um, the one that is alive, please. Let me see she's dead. One down. The difference between them and me is I have to walk all the way back to get these guys healed up. So don't just learn energy manipulation. It's simply a quick mental attack that exhausts the target for one turn. Ooh. And it does damage. I don't need this one. The thing about cheap attacks are that like you can do them all the time. But then you don't have the powerful ones to back it up. So you gotta kinda balance though. I think this just goes to the, the wall there. Oh, there's another guy here. I'm afraid I won't be able to get back. So... What does my map say? Oh, no, that's not the shortcut even. The shortcut is here. It gets you to there, but you can, like, do this mess. Wow, this place is huge. Yeah, these are roots, guys. Freaking Pokemon where it's like, you walk three steps, congratulations, you're in another town. That's not a root. These are roots. These are like... I'm not sure I can live. Like, in the anime, Ash took how long to get from one to one city to the next? He took weeks. Uh, he ran all the way there from uh, Pallet Town to Viridian City, but that was him running all day. He left er kind of late morning, but he got there, like, after sunset. And he... Or no, he got there, like, sunrise the next day. So it took him, like, nearly a whole day of him running and going down the river and everything. Like, it, it was a big deal. In the games, you walk for, like, 20 seconds and you're there. So, yeah, this is more difficult, more challenging, but at least it's more interesting and feels like a real game. Do-do-do-do. Oh, that's kind of cool. <clears throat> And they already have, like, so many things already built in that Pokemon fans were, like, asking for years. Like, I know technology is better now and it's easier to do these things, but still. Pokemon was like, can we do this, this, and this? And Game Freak's like, oh, yeah, that'd be cool. And then they just didn't do it. Uh, and then this one is just like, well, we're doing this now. Because this is the way that things should be. It makes sense. Although, I think you can't have it where 
the Temtem aren't around you now. I think you have to have a Temtem out at all times. Which is now the opposite of how good that is. Bye bye. I thought it would be like a fire type or something, which would be kind of cool, but oh well. Bye bye. I wonder if there's a max level for these things. It seems like 99 is a very far way to go, or 100 is a really far way to go. I always forget that it's 100, but it's 100. I'm thinking like Final Fantasy is 99 or something. Oh, we gotta heal these boys up. And girls, boys and girls. <laughs> Further your training at the dojo in Ari Sola. Ask about the Riverine Fellowship in Turesk. These are places that I haven't been to yet. But when I can climb, it would be easier to get through here. But until then... Until then, we get to walk the long way. It's not too bad, but as long as we don't hit the battles. The random battles are killer. Literally killer. And that's kind of cool that this is actually work in progress. Work in progress content. I think that actually means, like, for the game itself. Isabel, enough fighting for now. What is your name? Oh, you're the one that I haven't talked to yet. I'm just hunting Temtem. I study at the Academy. Do you know about Synergy? I've heard about it. Listen up, when you're fighting alongside a friend, it matters what Temtem you're using. It matters a lot. If you have the right combination of Temtem, you can greatly improve damage. I see, for example, if you're using a fire Temtem and your fire friend is also using a suitable type of fire... Uh, Temtem, -tem, then you might both increase your fire damage. It won't work if your friend is using a different type. That might mean the difference between victory and defeat, so you should learn about synergy and how to use it. Cool. Thanks. My pleasure. I love helping new train new tamers. So that's a Temtem. -tem, that's what Temtem -tem fighting is all about. Solitar solidarity and friendship. Okay. That was solitariness. Being solitary. Um, cool. And now let's practice a bit, shall we? Does this guy have two out? That's strange. I have to look at him in a second. What you got? What you got? <clears throat> Cause I got a pig and a bee. Oh, I think Ukama is a water type. Actually, I think they're both water types, so this guy's gonna get screwed over big time. Um, nibble and DC beam to you. Water cannon. Oh my god. And it poisons? Oh shoot. Well. Here's hoping. <laughs> Dude, you got sniped out and destroyed. Um, maybe this? We're gonna kick this one. Wait, energy manipulation. I can do this one now. DC beam, we're gonna kill you off here. I hope. And then you can't attack. You can. Wait, is it me that can't attack? Is that the thing? Please, I hope I can attack first. Oh, it destroyed. So if you attack, oh wow, wow. Okay, that move did a lot. Okay, whatever, whatever happened. Amazing. Sinone is poisoned. Genki is legit. Yeah, you need that electric type to help you with that water. Could have been better, but that's a good start with Blade Tamer. Thank you. It was kind of unfair, though. It was 2v3. Okay, so now I'm over here. Um, let's see. We did... Yeah, the, the map changes because of the level you're on. So I was up there. I uh, can't do that. Can't go over there, I guess. So there. That's something I haven't seen before. Uh, we got to do... We can go there. I think that's got to be a safe house. I hope that's a safe house. Because there's one here. No, that's not a safe house, then. Because they look the places where you can heal look like that. Um, I wonder what that is. Let's go find out. If there's no trainers along the way, there is a, an item or two or three there. Tiny crystals, simu, sin, s scintillating dust, sparkly, sparkly, can be sold at a good price. Son of a, wow. Pick it back. Isn't there a Pokemon called Picky Peck? That's what I'm thinking of. Pick, so, but this is like Peggy, Piggy Pig, Piggy Pick, Piggy Pick. I don't know. Uh, we're doing DC Beam, and we're doing Heavy Blow. This guy's level 8. I should be okay. Uh, 
Bye bye. Level 9. Genki's gonna be legit soon. <laughs> Oops. Silicon fragments. Bits and pieces of silicon in high demand in Chipanku can be sold at a good price. So I got money, basically nuggets, I think. Is that guy a trainer? I don't want to fight him. Work in progress. This is another thing I can't do yet. Work in progress content. Okay, let's see about this guy. Hopefully I don't die. Excuse me, do you know about Malachite Opens? I don't know what that is. Why, Malachite is that shop over there. Oh, when Malachite opens. Okay. Although I guess if you don't know that, then you wouldn't know when they open. Ho-hum. What's Malachite? What's that shop over there? What do they sell? They sell furniture, arts, and crafts. Sorry, I must go. Who are you? Stravos. Okay. Okay, well, people are excitingly interested in this area now. We're going to hopefully go through here without getting into battle, is what I was going to say, but, you know. Then a scale found me. Genki and Fluffy. A tag team. I just realized you can play this with um, keyboard. I keep switching between keyboard and mouse and I don't even notice. And heavy blow from Fluffy. Destroys. Oh! All but one health. Sand splatter. Okay. Wind blade. Scratch. Little tiny, tiny things, just in case. Try to one hit. Try to one hit. Hit him with the one two combo. Bam, bam. Okay, so that's where that shortcut leads up to. So if I learn to climb, that would be good. Oh. I'm gonna go heal. I don't think I'm gonna make it. Two scales. <clears throat> This is when I miss things like uh, that that one move that um, the other Pokemon, the other Thames I might have does that actually hits two at one time. Heavy blow. Show. Sure. Yeah, this is not good. No, not fluffy. No, not fluffy. One scale down. The other one's the easier of the two. <clears throat> Alright, Fluffy. Good. Soaking damage up across the team. This guy's going down hard right now. Oh, bam. One HP. Heavy blow. Shabam. No! Please, only one thing. It's the same battle! Oh no! Seven and nine, I guess? Seven and eight. Okay, well, maybe seven can go down faster, so let's go try to kill that. I think Fluffy's going down. Hopefully he can get in a good solid hit here. Yeah! And he killed him off. Awesome. Hit Genki. Hit Genki. You suck. Genki leveled up, though. Uh, we got Buggy. Buggy's gonna come out and save the day. We're doing DC Beam, and we're doing Ushriol. Home. Don't kill my Genki now. I need that guy. Wouldn't bleed him. <coughs> I think I'm going to have to uh, use a couple potions here. The bombs. The bombs. Get into items. Bomb. Use it on Genki. Yeah, that'll keep me alive. And then I want Buggy out because otherwise Sinone's going to die. It almost makes you think that I probably could have just gone through the uh, the trainers that were gonna, I thought were going to kill me. Probably just kill them and then maybe get to a, a safe place soon. But maybe not. Maybe this is the safer way to go. Whew. 
All right. Nope. Yep. Awesome. Really wish so I could climb. I wonder how you learn that stuff. I think that's the point is they make it look like, oh, you can climb, you can climb, you can climb, but not yet. You can climb, you can climb, but not yet. And then they finally let you climb. And you're like, yes, this is awesome. I've achieved something. So far, so good. No battles. You can also buy something. I forget what it's called, but it's a, it's a, the effect is a, a repel. It keeps things away. So you don't get into these random battles. Ganky team. I got a Genki ready for you. And a buggy. Now I believe... I believe electricity is still effective against these things. Eh, not really, never mind. Just normal. One fourth. Uses... Yeah, good. Rishol and DC Beam. One of those should kill. Yep. One down, <sighs> one to go. Sparks. Yeah, just raising a special attack is not going to do much. Hopefully I kill, kill him off here before he's able to do much more. We're going to use this one, because Windblade doesn't do anything. It doesn't do much, it's not effective. Oh shoot, okay. That was their special attack in, in motion. Yeah, awesome. I wonder how speed is chosen or if it's just random. There's gotta be some algorithm. Everything's algorithm, right? Everything is so algorithm. And then, okay, we should have only one more battle, maybe, maybe two after this. Before, before we go on. I need to get water in a second. Uh, Rishol and DC Beam, be right back. <clears throat> Here we go. Oops, not with that. Okay. Windblade. Looks like we did pretty good with the attack there. Goodbye. Scale goes down. Go through here and good. We got two trainers up here that are gonna look for a fight. That's absolutely fine. Wake up, you got company. Diego, Oriana, get ready to be beaten. Shut up and follow my lead. Let, let's see your Tim Tim, stranger. I'll fight her, I'll fight him, I'll fight you both. I don't care. Let's do this. I'll fight you both. They got another Yeah, okay. Oh, we're gonna destroy that with electricity. Uh, Urishol to that, and DC Beam to that. Goodbye. It's been fun. See ya. Use Peck. Doesn't do much. Bye bye <clears throat> Send out another water thing or something that's weak to electricity. Oh, that's... We need to kill that next, I think. That's effective, and I don't know if that is, but sure, why not? No. No, it's not, actually. But Urishol is. Oh, that's all I wanted was to knock it out. That's good. If I knock out one a, one a turn, I'm good. Tenderness doesn't help you there, dude. Pukey. And it's water. Oh, my God. So easy. 
Urishol, we're gonna kill you off with that and DC beam there. Goodbye. Yep, yeah, Urishol should be okay versus Loli. Loli, Loli. They need a pronunciation guide. That's what they should do. This is how you pronounce every single one of these. Of all of these Temtem. They need that. Because people are going to start communicating about these things and be like, how do you say this? And there's no anime or anything to keep it, everyone in, in check. They need a pronunciation guide. Oh, let's see. Buggy just learned toxic spores. You want to change? Let's see. Toxic spores. When carrying sp toxic carrying spores that inoculate with poison for three turns. What is not good? I don't need tenderness or sky or shy shield. Yeah, I want to change this one. It's not fair! Got 111. I wonder how the money's decided. Okay, we are at a crossroad here. A little fork. There's something of interest over here. <clears throat> I think that's just a trainer. I'm going to leave those guys alone. Maybe that was who I'm supposed to find. But I'm not curious enough about that yet. I'm going to keep going up here. There's a trainer here. Good day, fellow tamer. I've never seen you all around these parts. First time on this trail. How are you liking the Thalassian cliffs? They're lovely. Aren't they? They are the best the best antidote for city life, so let's enjoy them to the fullest, eh? Let's do some fighting. Oh, let's see. Oh, that's a water type, I think, so that's easy. I'm loving my electric. This is like having a Pikachu on your team. Yeah. Oh, it's level 18, though. Shoot. Oh, shoot. Level 18? Oh, my God. We're going to kick DC Beam again. Shoot, man. I think I got this. Like, it's not, I'm not scared or anything, but 18 is the highest level I've seen. Yeah, that's not going to help you there, buddy. Buddy, buddy. DC Beam is so powerful. Ready for a huge boost and. Yeah, there we go. Well done, fellow tamer. Oh, she looks so happy to lose. Everyone else was angry. She's actually, like, pleasantly. Pleasant. Pleasantly pleasant about that whole ex exchange. Oh, we made it to Ar Arisola. Finally made it to Arisola. Oh, we get the whole map. <sighs> yeah, see, that's... They'd be cool if these were all different. Like, the layout were different. I understand it, it makes it easier if they're all the same, because people know what, where, where's, what's what, and where to expect everything, but it'd be cool if they're, like, slightly different. Like, the tables are the exact same and everything. Are you in line? No, I'm just looking. Go ahead. Okay. Let's see. We're buying smoke bomb set. What does a smoke bomb do? The puff of smoke allows you to get back to the Temporium or safe place visited at last. Ooh. That's tempting. I only have to... I, I'm fine on this. Tonic, ether. Tonic? 15 HP and 12 stamina. Bomb. Wakener. I mean, I should have all these on hand, right? Revive is super useful, but that's like a third of my money right now. I think I'm gonna have to wait. Orange Wolf. Anyone in here that's not? You're an, you're an NPC. Confused Patron. Here's what town is this. This is Arisola. That's weird. These Temporiums are so similar to each other, I can never tell. Exactly my point. I guess the price of progress. Yeah. I mean, it's convenient that they're all the same, but it's also convenient, or not convenient. Uh, further your training at Sophia's Dojo. I want to go back and challenge those two people that were on the, the little overlook thing. Oh, 
over here. Hello, stranger. What brings you here? The views? How? How can I help? We could use a properly trained flying Temtem. We need a Temtem strong enough to carry a camera and well trained to get us exactly the shots we want. Sure, for science. Excellent. Let me take a look at your Tempedia and see what bird you might do the job. Okay, my young assistant, let's do this. Let's take a look at your Tempedia. Excuse me, no, no, better this one. Yes, this one. Bring me this one. Um, Pajaro is the only one that can fly. I'm going to carry a hammer enough to, but I don't think it's intelligent enough to understand a couple of extra barns. You pick a pet can't fly, can it? Yes, that's right. We need a barn sea. What's a barn sea? I don't think I know what that is. Tempedia? I don't think I've seen a barn sea. He looked at my Tempedia and then he's like, you need to get this one that you haven't seen. Yep, I don't know what he's talking about. Pickaback is the last one here. So that's okay. Well, you look at that. The house, the lake, stay away from the edge. The house. Yes, we're going high above it. It's scary. Imagine we're so high above it. Imagine if this little overhang just fell and it came crashing down on it. Oh, it makes me dizzy. The lake. I just love to jump from here and blam. Wouldn't it be cool? Just like movie, dude. Stay away from the edge. Yeah, bye. Dude, this place is insane. Okay. Not yet. Okay, I'm looking for a barn she. Gotta get the barn she as the riverine fellowship. Okay. For the training at the dojo. Let's go do that. Let's go find the dojo. What's over here? Where am I? Am I this? Oh, I'm not the guy. I see where I am. Yeah, I thought so. There's something over here. I learned about game design. To make a dead end interesting, put something at the end, like treasure. It'll make your players happy. That they that their efforts were well valued. And then you can just chill over here too. Just hang in here. You can even scoot over. This is cool. There's an exclamation point here. Over here. This person? What you got, dude? Get up, dude. Talk to the guy. There you go. Nice day for a walk. What's up? Is that your kid? Where? Her name is Laliana. Just look at her. What? What's up? I have to go. Okay. Not sure. Not sure. The guys around the is the last reminder of how Hatless Hill would have looked before Ari Solo was built on its flat top. Natural springs like this one originate all around the Fallacian Cliffs, especially near the source of the Upper Indigo. Okay. Wait, did the... Yeah, the uh, font changes. What's up? Dojo door man. Sorry, Tamer, but the door is closed. You can't come in. Why is it closed? The Dojo master is not in. We were waiting for her to come back. As a matter of fact, it's taking her longer than usual. I'm starting to worry. Where is Sophia? She said she was going to teach, catch some Temtem around Windward Fort. She took her surfboard, so there's no reason why she's gone so long. When will she be back? Okay, I will go find her. Where can I find her again? Windward Fort. Is, that, is there another route? There, that's, then it's a scenic route for you. Leave our solo and go north. You'll have to go to the, through Gifted Bridges. It's a long way, but there's no, there's no getting lost. Windward Fort is at the right end of it. Oh, I think I have to walk the long way. Beyond the Gifted Bridges. Oh my. Okay. There's something here. I'm S, not a tourist. I'm the guide. S... I'm sorry, but the tour has to start at this way at the main point of the guy. Oops, sorry. I'm so stressed out with this thing. Uh, what's up? Can I help? Maybe you can. Oh, send Kalazoo. So, what? How do you know it's knees? You can just leave the main sites. No, I think so. I could try. Sure thing. Thank you. The group is over there. Just go and give them a tour. I don't know. Improvise, pretty please. That's me. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Arizola. Describe the first time of the Asian poets. I think. Fascinating. What a city. The majestic massif 
of Ride Rock, you can see towards the south on the way to Bridgetail the Mars called. Oh, the Thalassian Cliffs. Oh my god, I actually have to learn stuff. They descend all the way down to the shore of the Solaro River. Excuse me, just one question. What's on the other side of the river? Uh, the town of Tresca? Tresca? Right. A quaint little town that boasts the ancient riverine fellowship, the last of the sailor brotherhoods of old. Oh, one last question. What do you recommend we visit next? I'm really into history. Uh, the Gifted Bridges. The Ruins of Windward Fort. Oh, I love castles. Oh, castles. I love castles. We'll see if it has something on the on the one in Lok Ador. Enjoy the rest of your stay. Sweet. You did it. Thank you so much. Now just to herd them back to the hotel and done for the day. You have earned your rank insignia as a true and honorable tuner guide. I got an umbrella. Damage taken from water techniques is reduced by 20%. We're proudly yes. Sweet. I don't think I have to do that. I think... I think I'm good. If not, they'll probably wait for me to finish up later. Okay, this place is big. What's over here? This looks like equipment shops. Cosmetics? Ooh. Ooh. I want this one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, everyone does. Wow. Those are cool. This guy has the shorts. Wow. I don't have that much money, though. Not even close. What do you sell? Can I change the color naturally? That's what the hints are for. What do you sell? Okay. Okay. Let's see if there's anything else to do here. Talk to this guy. Hmm, or boots? Hmm, or both. Oh, you can also get this thing. Wow, you can get all this stuff. I wonder if it updates daily or whatever, but these are cool. Wow. You can buy certain color palettes. Aren't those the same thing, just different order? I wonder. Oh, you can go bare naked. Bare chest. Can I go bare? Can I actually go bare? You can. Wow. You can run around naked. <laughs> Why would you do that? You can change the color though. Oh, I guess. Huh? Oh, okay. So you can you can dye the stuff that you already have. And okay, that's cool. Oops. I didn't hit it. I don't know if I did that correctly. This is cool. You get like one set of things, but then skinny jeans. Do I have to wait for it to load? Or did I not hit equip? Maybe I didn't hit equip. 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 Interesting. Okay. Work in progress. Or saw the airship terminal. Please do not leave your baggage unattended. Airships for Omanessa. Where? How does this place work? I have an airship to take. It work. It just works barely. This is cool. Wow, you're like high in the sky here. This is cool. They, it's a 2D game, but they put it into, um, they made it look like you're really high up. I wonder if I can just get on the ship. Or I don't think I can cross onto it, right? Yep. Let's talk to you. Good morning. Give us a normal. How do I get a ticket? I'm afraid you can't. Okay. Can't get it. This is the, like the SS Anne, but it flies. This game gets cooler and cooler. Cooler and cooler. Is it faraway places? I'd like a ticket? Oh my god. 50,000? I was like the walking. 
Oh my Jesus. Oh, let's see what is this here. How do I get how do I get on one? How do I buy one? I want it an airship. Okay, let's just keep going. Oops. Okay, I want That's the dojo. That's something that we haven't seen. Um, I guess I go north from here then. Okay. Hopefully we should be able to catch new Temtem. Not you. This guy over here. Right, it's this guy. No, it's not. It's over here. There's nothing here. Here's my buggy. Okay, maybe it doesn't have it yet. I don't know. I do not know. One more house, just for fun. Why is this guy talking to me so long? Nope. You're just peasant like me, then. Are you liking the big city? I love ours, hold on. Okay. Hi there, friend. Are you heading for the Gifted Bridges? Yes. Before you do, do you have a map for the Gifted Bridges? No. But I have a ten assist file. What? Relax, man. I was just asking whether you had a map. No problem if you don't. Oh, okay. Gee, people are on the edge these days. I, I, like, I'm here just to give you, I don't know, a quest or something. Like, chill. You won't get lost that much, is for sure, but there are plenty of wild temtem -tem lurking in the grass, and sometimes the non temtem -tem fauna can be best if you catch my drift. The usual route for tamers going to windward forts. Sometimes they get overexcited. They jump at the slightest chance they have a ten-ton battle, so just be warned. Okay. Okay, you get a map anyway. It's gonna tell me, yeah, exactly. Yep. Can't sneak by these guys. This guy's name is Instinct, that's cool. I think I lagged out. Lag, lag, lag. Cool. Okay, we're killing him with uh, electricity there. I need to switch Buggy out again. Buggy's gonna get too strong. We're gonna destroy the FOMU. Bye bye. That works exactly how I wanted it then. It's the best scenario. Scratch. Tis but a scratch. Swally. Mm -hmm. No, I think Ursul is good against him. And we're gonna do that again. Okay, not very good. Urshul will be fine. And DC Beam is going to kill this thing. Yep. Bye bye. They went from 3 to 1 and without being able to defend themselves there. Ganky, get ready. Okay, we got another Ganky. Oh, Urshul. And. Wind Blade is not going to do anything. It's DC Beam is my best bet. Yeah. It helps being double the level. I still can't believe they gave me a level 18 to kill. Like it worked, but jeez. Then there were these two. 
Fortunata, Jacinta, Saku, and Ukama. Okay, we're killing off the water type first. Level 13, though, this is. Thank God for uh, type advantage. Ouch. Okay, I want Uri Shell for this, and I want DC Beam for you. Oh, that's not good. I hope Buggy gets his attack in before he dies. Good. That's a shame. Bye, Buggy. Genki's gonna be a, a freaking beast. Um, we're gonna put in Picky Peck just because I want to give him experience. I think he'll live. And then we're gonna go back and heal after this. DC Beam. I was hoping it'd be effective. I'm not sure if Saku turns into a flying type or not. That's okay. I don't think Windblade does anything, so we're gonna have to keep doing this. But this should be enough to kill. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> pig, pig, pig. Okay, we're getting, again, that's the poison. Um, oh, I can cross the river here. Cool. That's gonna be useful now. Okay, let's go back and heal up. Because I'm a scared little toddler. Speaking of which, good, only one, and it's a Pahro. He's gonna go down, man. Be blue. Bye bye. I think it's the first time I've ever one hit anything on the first try. On the first turn of the battle, boom. Turn is over, or game is over in one turn. I could just sit here and level up. Oh, that's not the thing I was looking for. It's not where I parked my car. So I don't know where it is. Okay, I do. I didn't, but now I do. I think they should put this there. I think they should switch these out. Maybe it's because they only have three of them there. But I don't access my box nearly as much as those things. I haven't even touched the grass, and it's like, you found monsters. Oh, sure. Goodbye. Urishol. Yeah, Buggy's not actually doing much in this, other than he's going to take damage, but... Yeah, this is good. I'm not taking anything from this one. We're not taking no for an answer. Oh my god. Very first and very last. Can I just like automatically do this one and you just assume I win and kick its butt? Genki's my freaking VIP right now. Um, I'm gonna put him first and do that. I'm gonna switch these out. I really want to lead with Buggy or with uh, Genki though. Hey, come here. Look at this Temtem I just caught. I bet you can't beat me if I use this one. Only one way to find out. You ready for this? 
Are you ready? Are you ready for this? Oh, shoot. I hope that's still a water type. I think that's evolved off of, uh, what, FOMO or something? Whiplump? Whiplump? I don't know. Uh, we're gonna nibble, and we're gonna DC beam it. It's ice type. I think water. Yeah, that'll work. And we nibble it for a second, and it's gone. Level 15 guys down in two hits. No prob, Bob. Genki's level 14, man. I thought this Tam Tam, -tam was invincible. Nope. He dies in one hit, man. Got another trainer here. I'm not in the mood for a chat, but I guess to fight. Let's rumble. Okay. Water types. If Genki lives, we win. Nibble. They're both level 8. DC beam. DC, electricity is such a cheap thing here. Oh, I should have done that. Oh well. Slap. Okay, well, if we switch, then we're good. Yeah, pick a pick. Nib nope, not nimble. Nibble. He's got two moves that are the same thing. DC beam. Bye bye. Pukey's down, and Kalazoo is down now, too. Pick. Level 10. We also got another piggy pack to kill. I got mine at level 10. He's a level 7. Uh, we are going to nibble it and we're going to zap it with electricity. What happens to a piggy pack when it is zapped by electricity? Everything else? The same thing that happens to everything else? Oh man, I'm not a big fan of switchbacks in games or in real life. They really take it out of you. Drain your re all kinds of resources. Nibble and DC Beam. That's okay. I keep doing that. Nibble. DC beam. Let's take it down. Yep. It's a great time for some Tim Tim sparring. No introductions? Sorry, I'm Valerie. I'm S. Pleasure to meet you, S. Now let's get down to business. It's business time. That's why I'm wearing business socks. Oh man, homeboy is good. If I do this, is that my whole turn? No, cool, he's gonna use that and then meanwhile he's gonna keep this going. So he's gonna keep the team alive and then he's gonna use that and if pick a peck dies, I don't really care. One burst, good. Take up two damage, two attacks there, nice. Nicey nice. Uh, we want our weakest one. It's gonna be Fluffy. We're gonna do Heavy Blow, and we're gonna do DC Beam. This, uh, Paharak is going down. Cool. Heavy Blow to the Duck. Psypot. It's like Psyduck, but Psypot. <clears throat> you always lower your defense right before I attack you, buddy. That's not a good strategy, man. Heavy blow. DC beam. Let's go. Ouch. Bye bye. I hope Genki evolves. Genki's pretty beast already, but if Genki evolves, then even more power. Hey, I've seen you talking to Genova. I've seen you talk to Genova too. Of course, you fool. You are right by my side. Shut up, you just said you're not speaking. We're not speaking to him. Um, I gotta go. Of course we aren't. You're trying to steal Giovanna. What? Okay, I have places to be. 
They're not gonna let us go. Time's them up. Catchphrase. <sighs> I think it's good against the flying type, but or the the wind type, but it's not good against the the nature type. So it's like it only does like normal damage. Ah, oh, so close. Good, they're not actually attacking. Bye bye. One more round. Oh, never mind. They got more. <clears throat> Fluffy's almost 13 now. Homeboy's going down. Bye bye. That's pure uh, wind type. Oh, so close. I think it's the same exact thing that happened before. We're getting rid of tenderness for sure. DC beam for that, it's gonna knock that out, and then we're gonna do sand splatter and see if that does damble damage or not. Bye bye. Arr. Yeah, okay. That was a bad idea, but it doesn't matter. How could I lose, dude? See they're both salty. I've only seen like one happy trainer that I've paid attention to. Item. Two cents. Uh, lavender. For some reason, yeah, this is the scent is the uh, the repel. Right. Okay. Can't climb up there yet. Very busy, got flowers to pick. Looking for Temtem? No, of course not. Picking flowers? That's my job. I'll leave you to it. I think I gotta go in the big grass patch there. Nothing that way, so only this way. There's a battle here. Kaku! I'm gonna do sand splatter and see if that does much. Okay, electricity is a bad idea. And I might not live. Oh man. Oh, Genki's gonna die. Okay, Genki's out. Um, we're bringing Sinon. Take that heavy blow there. Let's go. Operation kick Kaku's butt.
bring you that salt. Cool. Acquire the goods from Lorenzo near Turquesa. Let's see how we're doing on the map there. I have to go through all of that just to get a safe place to stop. I think I'm going to get there and stop for the day, but right now i got to get back to where I came from. i got to get... Is it... Man! It's tempting to just keep going, but I think I should... I should go back. It's getting scary, guys. And besides, a lot of it just had trainers back here. I think it's mostly safe to get back. Oh, you can do it. Just jump over the switchbacks. I gotta walk through here, though. And there's... Oh, I thought... I thought I had a fight. But it was just I was on the edge there. Okay, I think I'm safe going back now. Oh, not here. Okay. Well, whatever. I can do a battle or so. Or not. A battle or so. Or not. It's like some I, I picked up repel. Okay, good. Okay, that was a safe way all the way back. Oh, we're over here. beans. <clears throat> Got my pig back. I still don't have a team of six though because I'm waiting on different, different types. Speaking of which, what the heck is the pig? Squad. What are you dude? You're just wind. Right. I think it's funny that they have a flying pig. It's like when pigs fly and it's like, yep, we got that. Load, man. This is what happens when you have bad internet. Okay, don't know how long I was able to move. Oops. I'm surprised I haven't gotten into a battle for a while now. I think there's one here now. There we go. There we go. Okay. We're going to nibble. We're going to destroy. Ouch. <clears throat> Sorry. Oh, my pig is flying high. I really want something like a Pikachu in this though, because I think electricity would be really strong. But at the same time, Gank Genki is doing pretty freaking well. It's interesting in this game, you can't, it doesn't look like you can avoid trainers. In Pokemon, you can usually avoid at least most of them. Oh, another posh one. Are you with that RB or yeah, no? Okay. Oh, this duck is gonna die. I wonder if it's less than 18. If it's less than 18, that doesn't really make any sense because this game doesn't scale well then. It's level 16. Yeah, that's weird. It's very strange. Oh, uh, we're gonna nibble. And we're gonna zap it full of electricity. Because the only thing that's happened now is I'm stronger. And that's a weaker battle. Should be enough to kill it, right? 
Oh man. Okay, well it's just a, okay then even better. It's like free defense. Mm. See ya. See, she's just sad. She's not angry. That's good. There's like angry, sad, and content. Yeah, I can't even get around the little barrier. Couldn't even jump over it. No, we don't have tea. What? 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 Tell your mistress we're not her servants. I don't. I'm not who you think I am. I don't care who you are. I don't care who she is. I'm going to show you who I am. Schizophrenics, man. Fighting the schizophrenics. Okay, well that's the starter there with a the crystal. Crystal type. Don't know what's strong against that, but that looks like a. Oh, that's a barnshee. That's a barnshee. I wonder how I get one of those. Okay, so we're gonna do nibble on this. And we're gonna DC beam the hell out of it, because I think it's flying type. It's a wind type. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Goodbye. And Chris, the other thing's only level 6. That was the hard thing. Crystals are either really strong, or it has to do something with electricity. Uh, heavy blow, we're gonna do that instead of um, nimble. Instead of nimble. And then chain lightning. Wow! This miracle of electric manipulation bounces three times clockwise. Decreasing damage. That sounds like it'll hit me too, though. But I don't need that. I don't need Nimble. Nimble doesn't do anything, so let's do that instead of Nimble. But we're going to try that out on the crystal thing. We're going to do Heavy Blow here, and then Chain Lightning here. See what this does. Yeah, it did damage to myself. Bye bye. Cool. It's not actually too bad because I think I'm strong against electricity, so it doesn't really do anything. It just like hits me a little bit, but it, it destroys them, so it's a little bit of bounce back attack. But, uh, but it's okay. Oh, there's my there's my uh, temporium right there. I need to get all the way over there. <clears throat> I wonder if I can make it. I really like how you can see it in the background. You can see the detail over there too. Like things are actually alive there. I got a little bit of grass to go through and maybe a couple of trainer battles, but I think I should be okay. I got most of my team left anyway. Three times the bomb. I should probably use a bomb. Okay, I'm gonna use a bomb. Or, nah, let's just do this. Let's do that. This is cool, you can move or you can switch them. So you can do this and switch, or you can do that and just move them over. That's cool. <clears throat> very intuitive, very easy to figure out what's going on here. We're just yours. We know nothing of local custom. Never okay. They're gonna battle us anyway. That's a shame. I understand. Yeah, they always think like, oh, there's ways to get out of it, but it looks like you have to battle everyone, no matter how pleasant of a person you are. This is good. We're gonna. What is this do? Used in con. Okay. Energy manipulation. A simple yet quick mental attack that exhausts the target for one turn. So it exhausts you entirely. So let's go in and do that for that. We're gonna do chain lightning here. It should hit me as well, right? So exhausted entirely, I think. Not sure how that works then. Ouch. We're just gonna do this. DC beam. Keep it simple. One down. I really like how it calculates XP at the end of rounds too. It's very cool. Instead of like right away, it does it at the end, like right here. It's really nice. Really cool effect. Kaku and Kali Kazoo. Okay, we're using electricity there. That's not going to do anything there. So energy manipulation would be good. Psy wave would be good, but I can't use it for some reason. I'm not sure why. We're going to do hypnosis on you, and we're going to do DC beam on you. Bye bye. Kalazoo is knocked out. Got a 50% chance to go next then. Good. <coughs> hypnosis. Good night. Oh, it wasn't affected. Oh, shoot. That sucks. Oh, it's caffeinated. That sucks. Okay, well, Sinone can take damage. That's okay. 
We're gonna use Psy Wave on you, and we're gonna use Wind Blade. Wind Blade won't do much. Wind Blade won't do much, so we're gonna do DC Beam. Even though it's not really that effective. Eh. But that should do wonders, okay. Not really wonders, but enough. Genki's gonna eat the, eat it. We're gonna rest, and we're doing Chain Lightning. Chain Lightning will kill me, DC Beam is okay. But I wanna do that, I think that will be better. I wonder if it's enough to kill. Yup, sure is. Sure is. Sidon took poison, but is no longer poisoned. Okay. <sighs> Looks like I got one more trainer. And this battle. Shoot. Oh, dude, we can get the duck. We gotta kill the pig, pig off. I think. Do we? Come on, man. Really? Sweet deal. Easy. Um, you're going to my squad. I got a water melee. Yeah, you're going to my squad, dude. Sweet deal. Hell yeah. That's a good way to end this. Gank, you can go. See ya. We're almost back to where we need to get to anyway. So now, take that experience. Level up, man. Go for it. Uh, we're taking out... Sci-Pot, sure. Let's go. That's cool. You can catch and then reuse in the same battle. That's so cool. That is so, like, in Pokemon, you could do that. You could be like, oh, look, there's one. Let's go catch it and then use it right away. It was, It's awesome. This game is so much better than Pokemon already, guys. Water Blade. And you can just use the water attack and stuff. Oh, my God, guys. Piggyback doesn't have a chance. Bye-bye. The only thing that's weird is the grass. If you look at the grass, it has like these little things that like pop out of it. It looks like... I think they're supposed to be blades of grass, but they look like little worms poking in and out. Okay, I think this is the last guy, and then we got our thing. Another traveler. Safe travels, my friend. And welcome to the gift best spot in Gifted Bridges. Nice tall grass close to the Temporium where your Temtem need to be patched up, and you can even take a swim and cool off. The only thing I was missing, it was some action, and then you came along. Let's make it a perfect day. He's going to make me sad here. He's going to make me sad. He's only got the one. Oh, it would be so nice if I had the electricity to go with this. Make short work of him. This might take my entire team to kill off then. Level 20, too. Um, energy manipulation. Gotta try it. And we're gonna do heavy heavy blow. It says Barn sees neutrality. I don't know what that means. Maybe it didn't affect it. We're gonna go with... Buggy. Oh, I can look in the Tempedia and see where this guy is. Maybe he's an evolution of something I've already seen. I think that's not going to help. Let him do anything. Yeah, sinon has gone. Hmm. Oh, good. Taking a good hit there. Um, let's get Psypod out. Let's get, get him leveled up a little bit if we can. If he lasts lasts the round. What does Stare do? Oh, defense down. It's dumb. Marshal Strike. We're using this, and we're using Urshul. Let's go. Wind Burst. Oh, Psypod took, took the hit. Oh, well. Buggy's going to get some experience here. Oh, or not. Okay. Fluffy, get ready. Let's go. This is dangerous now, but they're both full health, and hopefully we'll survive at least a few. Herschel. Yep, it'll take two hits to get all these guys down. And he got hurt from exertion, overexertion. Sweet deal. Take that. I don't care, dude. Yep, give my experience, please, and thank you. Congratulations, travelers. Thank you. 
And we're at the Temporium. I hope that guy isn't going to face me. Good. <sighs> awesome. I'm catching Tim Tim. Yes. Tell me about Windward Fort. Say it's very cold. Tell me about yourself. Have a nice day. Cool. Where are we going now? It's like... Oh. Well, we just healed up. This is going to be easy. You shall not pass. What was his name? Did they say Gandalf? Oh, Gabriel the Grey. <laughs> I get it. He's basically Gandalf. You shall not pass. Oh, that's hilarious. Good old Gabriel. Okay, we're doing a short work of these guys. We're going to do uh, Chain Lightning here on Calibus. Water cannon. Oh, shoot. Goodbye, Sinon. And poison. That that move is insane. I don't care. We're doing that again. Side wave on this. I don't care. And then we're going to do um, chain lightning again. If that chain lightning hits, then we're good. Oh, shoot. I'm scared now. Well, at least that one's down. It'll be 2v1 in a second. What happens now? Do I get no experience for that one? I get no experience. That sucks. We're using Psypot and we're using... Yeah, we're using low-level stuff. I don't think water's gonna be good, but I have to... I want to use an attack and then heavy blow, of course. Yeah, one quarter. Calibus get some rest. Good. Rage. Remiss. Oh, that's the thing there. Uh, Mini Tam Tam are trained. Let's go do that one. And heavy blow. Sweet. Easy. Oh, I wanted to see the other one, but that's cool. That's cool. Gotta go heal up now. That guy took a lot out of me. Gandalf, you're insane. I dubbed thee Sir Gandalf. Gabriel the Grey. <laughs> Okay, let's see what happens when I talk to this chick. About time I took a break and you took over the shop, eh, Nicoletta? By what? 10 10 card. Okay. This isn't too bad. If you have the little checkpoint right there, then you can. Alright, Windward Fort. I'm not here to fight. Let's just talk. Or not here to talk. Let's just fight. Kick that one, and we're going to do our chain lightning on this. Wind burst. It's fine. Good. Well, 17 with Genki. <laughs> Easy peasy, dude. See ya. Oh, my starters will evolve. I don't know what time or what level it evolves at, but I can imagine I'm getting close. I think it's gotta be similar. I thought... Uh, the bug would evolve really soon, but it needed eight levels, so I had to get it to like level eleven because I caught it at like level three or something. And then um, the starters usually evolve around level sixteen, so uh, in Pokemon. So I'm thinking uh, if I'm level fourteen with it, it should evolve soon, in a level or two or five or something. We're at Windward Fort. We made it. Got to revive. Oh, the whole thing is a, it's a field now. Oh, shoot. That's a shame. 
Yeah, there's not. It doesn't look like there's any unique stuff in different areas. It seems like I could catch these guys nearly almost anywhere. DC. Sand splatter. Almost need to repel now. Oh, this, this scent. I know it's a little ha hazard, but I don't care at this point. It's effective. I got a map of this place. Um, let's just go out this door. Oh, there's a trainer. Shoot. Ready to rumble. Dang. Kick. I want to catch that thing. I wonder if I can... Probably not, though. It's being a... Because it's a starter. It's like catching a Charmander. You just won't be able to do it. Dang it. So electricity and crystal suck. Crystal dust. Ouch. What's wrong against crystal? Water? Fighting. Pretty sure fighting is good against crystal because it breaks it. Crystal is like, what, rock, I guess. So this isn't going to do much. Water might do something. Yeah, only half. Defense? Yeah, okay, cool. Water doesn't do much. But, maybe. Martial Strike, this should do a lot. That's gonna kill me. Damn. Gotta run back to the healing spot. That's gonna kill it though. Yep. Side pot for the win. Oh, it sounds like Team Rocket. <clears throat> I think I'm down by two. I got four left, I think. Yeah, these two are done. The other ones are full health. Okay. Okay. I should be able to get back safely. Come on, piggy pick. Yeah, dude. That's probably a perfect damage amount.
Hopefully last one before I'm out of here. Good. Only one. Cool. Um, huh. Surprising it doesn't give me more information on the map. I'm gonna try it up this way. Seems like a different way to go. Uh, all this is just for this item. That's good. We got to a dead end. Silicon fragment. Coming through here. Random battle. Yep. Man, it's a lot of scales in here. I'm not sure there's anything else in here. Got our M. Okay, gotta go all the way to the other side. Past the trainers. Man, guys. <laughs> Sell Bell Sotos. Let's dance. Have to wait for it to load. It's a little slow, but I think that's mostly my connection. Don't know what to do except wait. There we go. Kick you, and we're gonna do chain lightning because that is a beast of an attack for this. Bubbles, not the bubbles. See ya. Now we're gonna do chain lightning again. We're gonna heal up here though. Um, so we're gonna use this and use a bomb on Ganky. Yeah. And we're gonna do chain lightning on Potterack. This should kill both of these two. Sweet. Awesome. Without even being attacked. Awesome. And we just got the one, whatever they have left. Hopefully another one that's weak against freaking lightning. Telekinetic shrapnel. Reported feels like combing your brain with it. That does a lot of damage. Okay, so it's a normal one that does damage. 
Um, <clears throat> I think it's like a stronger um, side wave. So if we take this one, it's the same thing, but it does more damage than this. I want to say it's just like side wave. Let's do that. Hypnosis, I'm thinking, is too useful to get rid of. Yep. Oh, uh, good. Hypnosis, in case it lives through this. It's only level 10. And Chain Lightning. No, no, my bad. DC Beam. <clears throat> wow. Okay, Genki's gonna rest. Oh, wasn't wasn't affected. Man, those things with caffeine. Can I do anything? I can do sparks. I can do DC beam. Okay. Sure, why not? I might fall, but Clan Bolesto prevails. Clan Bolesto. Team Rocket, Clan Bolesto. Right on. Marcy and Marcy. Okay, we're using Chain Lightning then. I think we're gonna do the same thing I did last time. All these guys are weak to a Lightning, dude. Kick. Now, you know what we're gonna do? We're gonna go back and use the item again. Item. Same thing as before. Bomb plus. Shoot. Bomb. That should be enough. And Chain Lightning. <clears throat> nice. Money, money. Money! We got a random battle here, but there's only one trainer there until our next part. Uh, we're gonna kick. We're gonna chain lightning. Strange. I want to see this happen. We're going to do DC beam there. <clears throat> bye bye. I think we should use items. Backpack, bomb, Sinone. We gotta wait. Okay, well, I think I just used too many of them. <clears throat> 